Hi, my name is Victor Robert Farrell. I am a writer. I'm a poet. Um, I am 57 years of age this February. It's now January 2017, and I'm recording this for my uh, Patreon account. And I hope you'll become one of my patrons. I have done lots of things in my life, right from uh, being a nuclear submariner at the end of the Cold War on Polaris boats in the Royal Navy, right up to uh, founding a charity and still being involved in that. But one of the core things that I do every day, every single day, is I write for about five hours a day. Uh, I love getting up and being sat working by five o'clock and usually out for a, a prayer walk uh, around about 10, 11 o'clock. Did I say prayer walk? Yes, I did, because the kind of poet that I am, uh, I, I describe myself as a biblical metaphysical realist, which is very difficult if you try to say it fast, biblical metaphysical realist. In other words, I'm from Derbyshire, and because I became a Christian, it's a dirty word that I know, but because I became a Christian on a Polaris submarine, if God wasn't real at several hundred feet underneath some ocean somewhere on a Monday morning, then he wasn't worth following. I found him to be real. I found Christianity in the Bible, biblical Christianity, to be true. Organised Christianity, you can stick it. Oh yes, uh, I'm also an ordained minister, although I try and keep that quiet. I've been a pastor in churches, large, medium and small. And I've been a Christian for just under 40 years. I've presently got around about two dozen, that's 24 books to my name. And I work on, get this now, I work on around about 8 to 10, 250 page books a year. I've got myself into a routine. Let me tell you a little bit about it. Uh, the poetry, first of all, I fly under the name of Purple Robert, mostly because I've had a good kick in and I like to speak about the realities of life. Purple Robert's got seven volumes out at the moment, 66 poems in each, with commentary as well. I also perform, I've performed, uh, well, last year at the Galway Fringe Festival, and this year I'm going to be one of the poets in the European City of Culture Hall, or as they call it, all in England. That's later on this year. If you're around, I hope you'll come and listen to me. I also produce another volume of books called Night Whispers. These are... 250 pages each. They come out four quarters of the year. Q1, Q2, Q3, Q4, and they are in your face, earthy, relevant, applicable, daily Bible insights. Bible devotions for people that want to have some meat in the morning. In addition to that, I've also formed a little group called the Fellowship of the Book, where we read through the Bible, the whole Bible, in one year. And again, we produce four volumes for this, Q1, Q2, Q3, Q4, which guides people with some daily observations on the whole Bible. The book that I'm most excited about and working on at the moment is called Finding the Spider, a unified biblical conspiracy theory. Yes, I am a conspiracy theorist. Woohoo! I'm a Bible-believing Christian, and that means, mate, that I'm part of the biggest conspiracy theory that ever existed. I'm expecting my patrons to be generous, and so I want to be very, very generous back. I want to like to give you insights of what my days consist of, but also give you access to all of my work, past, present, and future as well. So either look at the left-hand side or is it the right-hand side? I can't remember. One of these sides here, you'll see a number of patron packages that I want to invite you to get involved in. And I promise you, A, you will find that I'm generous. B, you will find that I am provocative and C, I reckon you'll be blessed as well. Did I tell you I've done a lot of things in my life and as I'm recording this from my favourite dead church in the county of Staffordshire in England, yes it is a dead church, nobody goes there at all, I'm in a graveyard full of dead people, the graves of which nobody attends, the names of which have all been worn off by the weather. Nobody knows whose these bones are just walking through the graveyard. And soon, that'll be me and you. So, loving life, what I want to do is invite you to be my patron, to partner with me in my writing, so that you can help me communicate to people the eternal life that the God of the Bible presents to people. To do it in such a way that's real and relevant, not only to the 21st century, but this time of the end in which I believe we live. So anyway, I hope you'll come along and be my patron and partner with me. 
and that we can enjoy good company and good friendship together for the rest of our mortal lives and warm ourselves on one another's friendship. Eh? Yeah, I think that was the six foot white rabbit that said that. <laughs>